what do they do forward in the sequel trilogy past that? And I'm very interested to see if they end up pushing further into that because so too. far, like, there's been so much hate for that that they've pulled away from it. That that's um, the that's the that's the tragedy that's right now of like online fan discourse is that in the prequels, you had the good and you had the bad, and you kind of like you made do with it, yeah. right? And you yeah. like, and then you had Clone Wars, and Clone Wars would be like, hey. Over here, you know, yeah. lead you in certain directions. Think about it this way. Mm -hmm. Go over this way. It's still George Lucas, you know. Sure. He's just, you know, he's mainly making an excuse to just make cool shit. Uh, yeah, really, and I'm right? sorry, not cool, not necessarily make the cool shit, but to make cool shit to make cool shit. Yeah. That's his, like, n one of his number one priorities. Yeah. How can I yeah. make this digital effect? How can I make a CGI yeah. character in a movie? Like, make it and work. And the story needs room to evolve and change and let kids that grew up with it think about it more deeply when they grow up and i i do kind of feel like there's this weird stopgap in the fandom right now where people aren't even making the attempt to try to think about the sequel trilogy themes deeper they just think sure. oh well they didn't know what they were doing so i'm not you know i like this one but i don't like these ones and i just feel like that's so against the the <sighs> sure i don't know the original feeling of what star wars was kind of meant to do which is just to like entertain you and make you think about some things and there's just like this weird stopgap where people were like i'm not gonna think about it i don't like it thus i would not think about it well what if thinking about it makes you like it more it's like nah. <laughs> i don't know what you're talking about <laughs> sure no i mean there's it, it's the same thing with like a lot of people didn't like the ending of the rise of skywalker sure. right with the 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 killing of Palpatine and the way Ray does it and everything yeah. and there's been like recreations of like a nice imagery sure that I think is there and that's what they're going for but it, it's not it's not visually there right yeah. it's it's more in the yeah. background but if you picture that in your head I'm like it all really makes sense as to what they're going for it does all these Jedi they've all been talking into Ray mm -hmm. they're all through her I'm all the Jedi I'm all the Jedi because they're all there and it's like the light side of the force yeah. is finishing this off and then where do we go from here and I, where I, do we I, go from here is so interesting that, that's 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 Could the thing you i want to see like you know, a but... new order of force users that have that their grand master can speak yeah to the jedi who came before especially if we and tell we... them all the failures they had yeah <laughs> we've taken out the first order we finally have taken out palpatine and yeah. stuff too you know like there's all these things that have been kind of holding back mm -hmm. what's been going on why the first order yeah. is still around you know it's like a remnants of the empire running by snoke mm -hmm. who's also like a a hand of the empire, right? Yeah. Like he's, he's still just doing the same thing. So I, I don't know. I, I want to see what they do and I hope they do it before, before everyone that was in those movies just gets too old or too jaded and they don't, they don't want to do it. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I get you. Cause, cause we, we waited a long time on the, the new, the star Wars sequel trilogy. Yeah. And then by the time we got to like, this is going to be Leia's movie. We lost Carrie Fisher and stuff too. Yeah. And I really want to be able to have like, I want to keep these characters and use them for, yeah. or these actors and be able to and I use them might be the I, wrong word, you I, know, I, I, but I agree. I, and I, I think see them there's, do so. I, there's this like, you know, I think there's this feeling in the fandom where it's like, well, we can put all the blame on Disney for us not liking these things. And I am going to push back. I put all the blame on the people that attacked George Lucas when he was making the prequel trilogy. <laughs> like, and I'm not saying like if you didn't like it, you're wrong. Sure. You're right in what like you are the quintessential person to go to about how you feel about something. I'm not sure. gonna tell you what you should or shouldn't feel. But the way the dude was treated, the way a lot of those actors were treated, like he was just like, fuck it. I'll just never make it anymore. Mm -hmm. You know? I think anybody that's like Kathleen Kennedy and like Disney, I think that you I think you're so dead wrong. Sure. I don't think you can be more wrong yeah. about who's to blame for the state of Star Wars. Sure. I think it's the people that were just, it's this fan reaction, vileness and hate and like, I know what's right and you don't, and you're not, you're not even allowed to enjoy it, you know? Sure. Like that was so prevalent in the prequel era to the point where I'm like, maybe I'll find some like weird chat rooms. And I did. <laughs> <laughs> of people that were like. I'd like it. And I'm like, yeah, me too. Let's talk about it. Yeah. Um, but now social media is so prevalent. And not only is it prevalent, but it's like, it's like one's over here blowing up. One's over here being like, oh, we're going to start now too. Like we have all this chaotic shit, yes. right? Yeah. The first order is dead. <laughs> and now we have all this new frontier to work with. And I just really, really hope there's this element in the Star Wars fandom that lets people that are enjoying it, enjoy it. In a way that, yeah, we can talk about what we don't like, but we need to be able to have room to not only talk about what we like, but 
let that grow in a way where you can have new storytellers come in and, and tell interesting things and new themes and symbiont circles and forced dyads and all the things that we use to relate to the galaxy far, far away in our own lives. Yeah. So and when I think yeah. about midichlorians, that's what I think about. <laughs> <laughs>